conclusion. Well, well let me press you on that because I Please. think in the case of the Mueller probe, uh, Bob Mueller did not find a chargeable collusion conspiracy. Well, that much we know. And let's look at, at Senator Booker. I don't know if you'll get like Jay Sekulow on me. I don't know. We'll see what happens. <laughs> For a guy on a good news day, he yeah. had his feelings. Yes. Uh, but I want to press you on this, sir. Here's what, how you described it uh, as recently uh, as, as 2017. Look. Please. And look, we're, we're at a point in American history where we're seeing a lot of dots uh, that are that are seem to be directing us towards a real problem and potential collusion because there, there continues to seem to be smoke um, uh, uh, that might result in an actual fire. In other words, uh, real collusion going on between us uh, and the Soviet Union. Real collusion going on. First of all, besides the fact that I did a flashback there and called it the Soviet Union, not Russia. <laughs> I'm glad you just were going to gloss over that and give me a pass. <laughs> well, real collusion going yeah. on, you said. Do you now have to revise that to say not chargeable collusion? Again, when I have a attorney general who, in my opinion, is suspect, filtering a report that I have not seen, I I'm not willing to conclude anything yet based upon a letter that he wrote. So you, but, but let me, let, let's ask press about me. it. Yeah, press me on that. But Bob Mueller didn't charge anyone for conspiracy collusion on the election. Right. So you know that at the criminal level, Bob Mueller's now done. He's not doing the probe anymore. Bob Mueller is a soldier that knows that his department has said a sitting president cannot be charged, cannot be indicted. Mm -hmm. and, and so, again, I, I think that this is, a, this is an issue for Congress. Let's look at the fact pattern. Let's look at the report and come to our own conclusion. Okay.